Hello everybody. Here we are again in Abbotsford, British Columbia on November 30th. I just wanted to show you guys something. I just harvested my ruby red radish today. Here's a close-up of my harvest and the tray. Now the reason I'm showing you is because I was dumbfounded today at the crop I got off of this came in at just under two pounds. I got one pound 14.2 ounces, which is crazy. I got that out of one tray. Um, that's the most I have ever gotten out of one tray. After it was washed and harvested, there goes Rob taking it away while I'm still talking about it. And now we'll go up here on my shelf because talking about color, that ruby red radish is really pretty. But this is my purple kohlrabi. Purple kohlrabi. Um, got a lot of purple down at the bottom. You get purpley stems. They're not, they're not uh, super purple all the way through, but they definitely have color. It's a nice looking healthy tray of purple kohlrabi. It's going to be harvested. We've been chipping away at it to give people samples. Uh, that's why you see it's partially cut um, and then we've actually been trying our hand at amaranth this is not the beautiful red variety of amaranth but it is still amaranth oh my goodness it has the most velvety feel to the top of it it's it's got to be one of the softest uh, trays of microgreens I have grown it, it is a little bit longer growth time for this product. Uh, it can take up to three weeks. That's the amaranth. And I have, this is just, I, I put my uh, sunflower shoots in this morning. I took the tops off and as you can see, they're just starting to flip up and turn green. They're a little yellow right now. As the day goes on, they will green up. And then we're going to slide on over here to my beets. Get right close in on those stems. Now, doesn't that look yummy? I love the color of beets. I love beets, period. But the color of these beets, oh, they would pizzazz up any dish. If you can see right here, they're laying over, but that's just because I just watered them. They will be coming back in no time at all. They'll stand back up. And that's, it. and that's it for today. We just haven't been on for a few days, so we thought we'd just give you an update as to where we are. My wheat grass down here is just about ready to harvest. I have four trays, and I have a broccoli brassica blend right here that will be coming out tomorrow. Have a great day. Have a great evening. Bye, everybody.